So, I'm recording this from my webcam, but, um, the rest of the video will be on my other camera. It just died in transition, so, man. Um, but, welcome to my channel. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Today, I am doing a fun collaboration with Veronica, The Beauty Within, 1987. And this time, we are doing a fun Disney collab. Um, we've been talking about doing more clubs together, and she's an amazing friend of mine, and you guys should definitely check her out if you're not already checking her out and subscribing, but we're going to be doing some Disney looks. Um, we're each going to be doing a character from the same movie, um, each week. So, this week we decided on Hercules, and Hercules has to be one of my favorite Disney movies, and, um, it definitely doesn't get enough credit for, you know, as Disney movies, not really that many people think about it. Um, when you think of Disney movies, you think of Ariel, uh, not Ariel, Little Mermaid, Sleeping Beauty, Snow White, Lion King, but, um, Hercules was my, one of my favorites. Um, I've always been a fan of, um, Greek history and, um, Roman history, so, um, I'm a very, very big fan. So, today I'm doing a look inspired by Hades, and he was the villain in Hercules, and I absolutely loved Hades because he was hilarious, dark, evil. But he had that sense of humor that just was like, you know, he's not really that bad of a bad guy, but, you know, he's relatable. <laughs> well, to me, anyways. Um, but the look that I'm doing today is really dark and smoky, um, paired with dark lips. Uh, so, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoy it. And definitely check out Veronica's look um, for Hercules. And she's going to be doing um, one of the characters as well. Uh, this is going to be a couple, like at least every Saturday for a few weeks. So definitely stay tuned. I really hope you guys enjoy our looks. And if you do, don't forget to subscribe and like and all that good stuff. And I hope you guys really enjoy. And on with the tutorial! <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to start by... Priming my lid with Urban Decay Primer Potion. I'm going to take a piece of tape to, ha to help keep your really sharp edge. Um, you can stick it on the on your pan or the back of your hand before you put it on your eyes, so you're not like ripping your skin um, when you remove the tape. But this just helps with a really really clean line and you don't have to worry about all that. Um, and then I'm going to take the liner or black base and just kind of do like a line. Um, it doesn't have to be anything precise or anything like that. And using my Lorac Pro 2 palette, I'm going to take this black. You can use any black that you have. And I'm just going to take it on a pencil brush. This is the e.l.f. Professional Eye Crease Brush. And I'm just going to blend it out with that black. And then I'm going to take this Artie Professional's um, eye color. And this is the blue. Um, you can use any dark navy blue that you have. There's also one in the Lorac 2 palette. Um, and there's so many different other ones. And I'm just going to take it on a, um, a flat brush and just kind of add it to the lid, blending in with the black. Um, this may take a few, uh, minutes to kind of blend it out to what you like or you don't have to it's totally up to you but kind of lay it on top of the black and just start blending all of that together 
And then I have this really, really cute palette. Um, and I'm just taking this light blue and kind of blending a little bit on the edge just to kind of help uh, it transition to the highlight. I'm going to add my highlight. I'm going to use a mix of Buff Snow and Beige from my uh, Lorac 2 palette. And taking the silver from this palette, as you can see this palette can be used for neutral looks or dramatic looks, like you can really use this palette for any look that you want. Um, I'm taking that silver on a little brush like this and popping that on the inner tear duct area and blending it and bringing it um, on the inner rim on the lower lash line. I'm going to add some more of that blue onto my brush and kind of sweep it on my lower lash line. Taking my Fergie Wet n Wild liner and Midnight Girl, just going to kind of line my bottom lash line. I'm going to take my CoverGirl Flamed Up Mega Curl Mascara in Black is Black and add a couple coats. You can add false lashes if you would like. Alright, and I'm going to apply the makeup for the rest of my face and then I'll be right back. Alright, so I did my face makeup. Um, for my blush, I just used Vamp from Quartz Cosmetics. And uh, my contour is Spring Fling Bronzer from Quartz Cosmetics. Um, now for lips, you can do a variety of lips with this. Um, you can do a black lip. You can do a blue lip if you have one, like those new um, NYX lippies that I'm in love with. They have like a blue and a green and a purple. Um, Veronica actually did a review on them, so I'm going to have those linked below because they're amazing and gorgeous and I'm in love with them. And I might go over to her house and swipe them. No, I'm just kidding. I wouldn't do that. <laughs> Anyways, or you can do, of course, a nude lip. Um, I'm going to do kind of a dark mauve lip. And I have two lip products. I'm using the Milani Lip Flash, and this is a Muse Flash, and it's like a dark burgundy. And then I have this Mega Slicks Balm Stain in uh, Lady and the Vamp, and this is just going to kind of like add some sheen to it. So, that is the finished look. Really kind of dark and sultry. And I personally really love it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, make sure to thumbs it up and subscribe if you have not. Definitely check out Veronica's look for our Hercules week. And stay tuned for more Disney-inspired looks. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you later. Bye!